हेलो बच्चो लेट्स रीड दिस क्वेश्चन द क्वेश्चन इज डिस्क्राइब द स्ट्रक्चर एंड फंक्शनिंग ऑफ नेफ्रॉन्स सो की कॉन्सेप्ट पे बात करते हैं चलो फर्स्ट पॉइंट नेफ्रॉन्स नेफ्रॉन्स आर द बेसिक नेफ्रॉन्स आर द बेसिक फिल्ट्रेशन यूनिट्स फिल्ट्रेशन यूनिट्स फिल्ट्रेशन यूनिट्स Which are large in number. Which are large in number. Which are large in number. Some substances in the initial filtrate. Some substances in the initial filtrate. In the initial. in the initial filtrate such as glucose glucose amino acids salts salts and a major amount of water salts and a major amount of water major amount of water are completely reabsorbed major amount of water are completely reabsorbed are completely reabsorbed as the urine flows along the tube as the urine flows along the tube along the tube the main component the main component of nephrons are the main components the main components of nephron of nephrons are are glomerulus glomerulus bowman's capsule bowman's capsule and renal tube and renal tube diagram mein dekh lete ek bar see this is glomerulus this is bowman's capsule and these are the renal tubes this let's move on to the next point the main function of the nephron the main function the main function of nephron of nephron is to filter the blood is to filter the blood and involves and involves the production of urine production of urine and the process involves are and the process and the process involves are filtration filtration reabsorption reabsorption secretion secretion and excretion secretion and excretion so describe the structure and functioning of nephron so the final answer of this question is nephrons are the basic filtration units which are large in number some substances in the initial filtrate such as glucose amino acid salts and a major amount of water are completely reabsorbed as the urine flows along a tube the main components of nephrons are glomerulus bowman's capsule and renal tube third the main function of nephron is to filter the blood in and involves the production of urine and the process involves are filtration reabsorption secretion and excretion i hope you understood it well best of luck